Protex Diamond Kitchen produces pounds of diamonds in an instant. They do it all way out in the desert, about 60 miles southwest of Deming. And the nearest town, I believe, is Windmill, which is probably about 10 miles away to the west. So uh, yeah, we're pretty isolated out here, and uh, it, makes, it makes a pretty good, uh, pretty good spot. They take a big piece of culvert tubing and set it on its end and start filling it up with explosives. Buried in the explosives inside the big cylinder is a smaller container of graphite. Pure carbon, what diamonds are made of after you apply a lot of heat and pressure. After the diamond recipe is prepared, the tech crew piles into an old armored car for safety. Five, four, three, two, one. Stop fire, stop fire. You can see the powerful shock waves produced by the explosion in the air and traveling through the ground. The result of every diamond shot is not shiny gemstones, but instead a gritty diamond sand. The unique shape of these diamonds makes them tougher than natural diamonds and superb for polishing jobs requiring extreme precision. Out in the desert, it looks a bit like a war zone at the diamond blasting range, evidence of a solemn commitment. Uh, I'm just interested in, in any way that you know explosives can better mankind. Bob Martin, KRQE News 13, near Plyus.